Presentation Plus is available exclusively with the new 4th edition of Interchange, the most widely used and the most successful English course in the world, incorporating video, audio, and even online resources, all with the click of a mouse. With Presentation Plus, your students will be laser-focused on the task at hand as you use the built-in presentation tools to highlight key concepts, reveal answers to exercises, annotate passages, play class audio passages and video segments, and even embed web links right into your lessons. Let us show you how Presentation Plus can help you deliver more engaging and effective lessons. Visit the link below or contact your Cambridge University Press representative for a demonstration today. How do you answer the workbook? First, watch the explanations video. Then, Answer three pages of the workbook by yourself. Finally, check the answers and see the correction. Enter change one, workbook answers. Fourth edition. Unit one. Please call me Beth. Exercise 1. Answers will vary. Exercise 2. 2. What's her first name? Her first name is... 3. Where is your teacher from? My teacher is from... 4. How's your English class? My English class is... My English class is nice. My English class is interesting. You write the answer. What are your classmates like? What are, what are, what are, what are, what are your classmates like? My classmates are nice. My classmates are friendly. My classmates are very kind. Exercise 3. 2. A. My name is Young Hoon Park. B. Nice to meet you, Young Hoon. Nice to meet you, Young Hoon. 3. A. Hello. I'm a new club member. Welcome. 4. I'm sorry. What's your name again? Jo Kang. Jo Kang. 5. How do you spell your first name? How do you spell your first name? A N T O N I O. Six. What do people call you? What do people call you? Everyone calls me Ken. Everyone calls me Ken. Exercise 4. 2. Jam and Bob. Jam. What's your last name? What's your last name? My last name is Hayes. 3. Jam. Who is that? That's my wife. 4. What's her name? Her name is Rosa. Her name is Rosa. Fine. Where's she from? She's from Mexico. She's from Mexico. Six. Who were they? They're my wife's parents. They're my wife's parents. Parents. T. Silent. Exercise five. Two. Hour. Three. Your. Four. He. 5. My 6. Hair 7. 
they it it exercise six Amy oh they are on the volleyball team let me introduce you hi Surachi this is Lisa Nell R is nice to meet you Lisa nice to meet you too where are you from R I'm from Thailand M and this is Mario he's from Brazil is is hi Mario exercise 7 name where from languages sports Mario Mario Cali Colombia languages Spanish and French sports volleyball 2 Charlotte where from Brussels Belgium Belgium Charlotte from is from Belgium languages French and Dutch exercise 7 number 3 so yen Wuhan China languages Chinese and English Chinese and English sports volleyball B answers will vary exercise number eight pretty good things are you a student here no I'm not I'm on vacation are you a student yes I am what are your classmates like what are your classmates like they're really interesting they're really interesting e silent Oh, really? Is Susan Miller in your class? Oh, really? Is Susan Miller in your class? Yes, she is. Is she your friend? No, she's not. She's my sister. Exercise number nine. Hi, I am Tina Fernandez. Are you from South America, Tina? Yes, I am. I'm from Argentina. Where are you and your sister from, Alex? We're from Taiwan. We're from Taiwan. We are from Taiwan. Are you from Taipei? No, we aren't. We're from Tanyan. Say, are you in English 101? No, I'm not. I'm in English 102. I'm in class. 102 not 101 exercise number 10 2 are you free no i'm not i am very busy 3 are you from spain are you from spain no we're not from spain we're from mexico 4 is your teacher mr brown no my teacher is not mr brown I'm in Ms. West's class. Ms. 5. Are Natalie. Are Natalie and Mike in your class? Are Natalie and Mike in your class? Yes. Natalie and Mike are in my class. 6. Is it an interesting class? Is it an interesting class? Yes. It's an interesting class. 7. Are they on the same baseball team? Are they on the same baseball team? No, they're not. No, they're not on the same baseball team. They're on the same volleyball team. Exercise number 11. Hello or goodbye? See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Goodbye. Good night. Goodbye. Good morning. Hello. Talk to you later. Goodbye. How's it going? How's it going? Hello. 
Have a nice day. Goodbye. Have a, have a good day. Goodbye. What's up? What's up? Hello. Exercise 12 answers will vary. Unit 2. What do you do? What do you do? Exercise 1. 2. Fitness instructor. 3. Flight attendant. 4. Newspaper reporter. 5. Tour guide. 6. Website designer. Exercise 2. He's a website designer. He works in an office. He likes computers a lot. 2. She works in a gym. She's a fitness instructor. She teaches aerobics. She teaches aerobics. 3. He's a tour guide. He takes people on tours. He travels a lot. 4. She works for an airline. She assists passengers. She's a flight attendant. Exercise 3. Number 2. She works for a travel company. A travel company. She arranges tours. She's a travel agent. A travel agent. 3. He has a difficult job. A a difficult job. He has a difficult job. A difficult job. He is a cashier. A cashier. He works in a supermarket. He works in a. He works in a supermarket. Four. She is an architect. Architect. H silent. H silent. She is an architect. She works for a large company. A. A large company. She designs houses. Designs. G silent. Houses. It's an interesting job. It's an interesting job. 5. He works with cars in a garage. A. A garage. He's a mechanic. A. A mechanic. He's also part-time student. He's also part-time student. A part-time student. He takes a business class in the evening. He takes a... He takes a business class in the evening. Exercise 4. Answers will vary. Exercise 5. Tom and Liz. Tom, what does your husband do exactly? He works for a department store. He's a store manager. How does he like it? It's an interesting job. He likes it very much. But he works long hours. And what do you do? I'm a student. I study architecture. Oh, really? Where do you go to school? Where do you go to school? I go to Lincoln University. My girlfriend goes there too. Really? And what does she study? And what does she study? She studies hotel management. She studies hotel management. That sounds interesting. Exercise number six. We have Victor and Mark. I work for Cyborix Industries. I work for Cyborix Industries. And what do you do there? I'm in management. How do you like it? Like it, yes, sound. How do you like it? It's a great job. And what do you do? What do you do? American also say, What do you? What do you do? I'm a salesperson. Really? What do you sell? I sell computers. I sell computers. T, soft D, and R as R. I sell computers. Do you want to buy one? Do you want to buy one? Do you want to? Do you want to buy one? Exercise 7. 1. He's a chef. 
too. He practices cooking new things, and then he writes cookbooks. 3. He makes TV programs about Thai cooking. 4. She's a lifeguard. 5. She works at the city pool. She works at the city pool. Pool. 6. She finishes work at noon. She finishes work at noon. Exercise number 8. Answers will vary. Possible answers. 2. Where does he work? Where does he work? 3. When does he start work? When does he start work? 4. How does he like his job? How does he like his job? Exercise 9. Everyone knows Pat at the hospital. Pat is a part-time nurse. He works at night and weekends. On. On. On Saturdays and Sundays, Pat sleeps most of the day and wakes up a little before 9 in the evening. Before 9 in, in the evening. Usually at 8.45 or 8.50. He has breakfast very late, around 9.30 or 10 p.m. Around. He watches television until 11 o'clock. Until. And then starts work at midnight. At, at midnight at 12 o'clock at night. Early in the morning, usually around 5 a.m., he leaves work. Has a little snack. Goes home goes to bed and sleeps late. It's the perfect schedule for Pat. He's a primary student on weekdays at local college. At local college. Exercise number 10. This is crossword puzzle. 1. Starts. 2. Takes. 3. Types. 4. Works. 5. Gets. 6. Sells. 7. Serves. Serves. 8. Does. 9. Goes. 10. Answers. Exercise 11. 2. What does he do? 3. She fixes cars. 4. He goes to the university. He goes to the university. 5. She stays a plate. She stays a plate. 6. He works part-time. He works part-time. Exercise number 12. 1. New York Hospital needs nurses. New York Hospital needs nurses. Work during the day or at night. Weekdays or weekends. Weekends. Full time or part time? Call 614 555 1191. So, exercise 12 one answers nurses at night, weekends, part time. 2. Interesting job for a language student. Interesting student. Mornings only. Take people on tours. Tours. Need good English and Spanish skills. Spanish. Email Dave at Dave189 at cup.org. So number two answers. Interesting. Student. Tours. Spanish. Exercise three. Number 3, exercise 12, number 3. 
No need to work long hours. Only work from 6 until 11 for evenings a week. Our restaurant serves great food. Work with our manager. Call 308-555-6845. Number 3 answers. Long hours. Until. Restaurant. Manager. Unit 3. How much is it? Exercise 1. The light blue, the light blue ones over there, they're nice. Rebecca, yes, but I don't really like light blue. But I don't really like light blue. Hmm, well, what about that sweater? It's perfect for you. Which one? This red one. Well, I like it, but it's expensive. But it's expensive. T soft D. Hey, let me buy it for you. It's a present. Oh, Sam, thank you very much. Exercise 1 answers. Yes, but I don't really like light blue. Which one? Well, I like it, but it's expensive. Oh, Sam, thank you very much. Exercise 2. How much are those bracelets? They're $29. How much are these shoes? They're $64. How much is that cat? That's my cat and he's not for sale. Exercise 3. 1. Backpacks. Two. Boxes. Boxes. Three. Companies. Four. Days. Five. Dresses. Five. Dresses. Six. Gloves. Seven. Hair brushes. Hair brushes. Eight. Necklaces. Nine. Rings. Ten. Scarves, scarves, eleven, sweaters, sweaters, T soft D, British sweaters, twelve, ties, ties, exercise four, answers will vary, possible answers. 2. That's cheap. 3. That's pretty expensive. Pretty. T of D. 4. That's reasonable. 5. That's not bad. 6. That's cheap. 7. That's not bad. Exercise 5. 1. Clerk. It's, it's $195. $195. And how much is that one? It's $255. Oh, really? Well, thanks anyway. 2. Meg and Clerk. Excuse me, how much are those jeans? Those. Those. They're only $59. And how much is this sweater? Which one? They're all different. This green one? It's $34. It's. Exercise 3. I like the sunglasses over there. Those. Which ones? The small brown ones. They're $199. Oh, they're expensive. So number three answers. Those. Ones. Ones. There. Exercise number six. 
cotton, gold, laser, plastic, silk, wool. These are the products in cotton. Gloves, pants, shirt, jacket. Pants, also pants, because I have T and there is N before T, I can make the T silent. Pants, correct. Pants, correct. Gold. Bracelet, ring, necklace. Leather. Boots, pants, gloves, jacket. Plastic. Boots, bracelet, ring, necklace. Silk, pants, gloves, shirt, jacket, wool, pants, gloves, shirt, jacket. Exercise number seven. One. Yes, but the leather ones are nicer. Nicer. They are also more expensive. Nicer, more expensive. 2. The silk jackets look more attractive than the wool ones. More attractive than. Yes, but the wool ones are warmer. Warmer. Warm. E-R. Warmer. 3. This purple shirt is an interesting color. Yes. But the color is prettier than the design. Prettier than. Prettier than. Prettier than. British. American. Prettier. Prettier. T of the Prettier than. Prettier than the design. The design is not bad. Design G silent. I think the pattern on the red shirt is better than. It's better than the pattern on this purple one. Better than. Four. Hey, look at the silver ring. It's nice. And it's cheaper than the gold ring. Cheaper than. But it's smaller than the gold one. Smaller than. Well, yeah. The gold one is bigger than the silver one. But look at the price tag. $1,000 is a lot of money. $1,000 is a lot of money. Bigger than double G. Bigger than. Exercise number eight. Clothing, electronics, jewelry. Clothing, boots, cap, dress, t-shirt. Electronics, DVD player, MP3 player, television, video camera. Jewelry, bracelet, earrings, necklace, ring. Exercise number nine, answers will vary, possible answers. Two, which cam do you like more? The wool one or the leather one? I like the wool one more. Or, another answer, I like the leather one more. 3. Which ones do you like more? The high tops or the sandals? I like the high tops more. Or, I like the sandals more. 4. Which one do you prefer? The laptop computer or the desktop computer? I prefer the laptop computer or I prefer the desktop computer. 5. Which necklace? Which necklace do you like better? The silver one or the gold one? I like the gold one better or I like the silver one better. I like the silver one better. Exercise number 10. 
one d two c three a four b exercise ten part b b one false two true three true four false exercise ten part c answers will vary different answers that's the end of unit number three interchange one for sedition unit four i really like hip-hop exercise one answers will vary exercise two answers will vary possible answers two do you like asher yes i do i love him i love him i love him three do you like romantic comedies no i don't i can't stand them four do you like adela yes i do i like her a lot five do you like video games no i don't i don't like them very much six do you like science fiction box? Yes, I do. I like them a lot. Exercise 3 1. Katy Berry is a singer. The Kings of Leon are a rock band. The Kings of Leon are a rock band. 3. Colin Firth is an actor. 4. Nanny is a soccer player. Exercise 4 1. Sarah and Ed Yes, I like it a lot. I'm a real fan of Keith Urban. Oh, does he play the guitar? Yes, he does. He's my favorite musician. 2. What kind of music do, you, do your parents like, Jason? What kind of music do your parents like, Jason? They like classical music. Who do they like? Mozart? No. No, they don't like him very much. They prefer Beethoven. 3. Scott. Teresa, do you like Beyoncé? Do you like peons? No, I don't. I can't stand there. I like Alicia Keys. I don't know her. What kind of music does she sing? She sings R and B. She's real. She's really great. She's really great. Exercise five. Responses will vary. 1. What kinds of movies do you like? I like comedies and musicals. 2. What's your favorite movie? My favorite movie is Avatar. 3. What kind what kinds of movies do you dislike? I dislike animated movies. 4. What kind what kinds of TV shows do you like? I like reality shows. I like reality shows. 5. Who's your favorite actor? Who's your favorite actress? My favorite actor is Mad Demon. Mad Demon. 6. What's your favorite song? My favorite song is let it be, let it be. 7. Who's your favorite rock band? My favorite rock band is U2. 8. What's your favorite video game? My favorite video game is Limbo. Exercise 6. Answers will vary possible answers. 1. Which movies are more interesting? 
musical or or science fiction films musicals or science fiction films science fiction films are more interesting than musicals exercise number 6 2 which films are scarier horror films or or thrillers Horror films are scarier than thrillers. 3. Which do you like more? Animated films or historical dramas? I like historical dramas more. 4. Which do you prefer? Romantic comedies or action films? I prefer action films. 5. Which films are more exciting, westerns or crime thrillers? Crime thrillers are more exciting than westerns. Exercise 7 A. Answers will vary, possible answers. Listen to, listen to jazz, listen to music, listen to the radio, play. Play the piano, play the guitar, play the trumpet, watch, watch videos, watch a sports match, watch a movie. B. Answers will vary. Exercise 8. A. 1. Ahead of time. 2. House of laughs. 3. Coming up for air. Exercise 8 B 1 Science fiction film 2 A comedy 3 A crime thriller Exercise 9 2 Do you like country music? I can't stand it B I can't stand it 3 There is a baseball game tonight Great! Let's go! 4. Would you like to see a movie this weekend? This sounds great! This sounds great! Exercise 10. A. Number 2. No. 3. Yes. 4. No. 5. Yes. Exercise 10. B. Answers will vary. Exercise 11. Kate and Robin. Kate. Yes, I do. I like it a lot. Robin. There is a Lincoln Park concert on Friday. Would you like to go with me? Yes, I'd love to. Thanks. 2. Carlos. There is a basketball game on TV tonight. Would you? Would you like to come over and watch it? I'd like to, but I have to study tonight. Well, do you like soccer? Yes, I do. I love it. There is a match on TV tomorrow at 3. Would you like to watch that with me? I'd love to. Thanks. Exercise 12. 2. Richard can stand classical music. 3. I love horror films. 4. Celia is not a fan of pop music. 5. Would you like to go to a baseball game? Would you like to go to a baseball game? Would you? Would you like to go to a baseball game? Unit 5. I come from a big family. Exercise 1. Males, females. Brother. Father. Husband, nephew, son, uncle, females, aunt, daughter, mother, niece, sister, wife. Exercise 2. Don, Joel. 
No, I'm not. My brother and sister are staying with me right now. Are staying. We go to bed after midnight every night. Really? What are they doing this summer? What are they doing this summer? Are they taking classes too? No, they're not. My brother is on vacation now, but he's looking for a part-time job here. What about your sister? Is she working? Working? I can make the G sign. Is she working? Yes, she is. She has a part-time job at the university. What about you, Joel? What about you, Joel? Are you in school this summer? Yes, I am. I'm studying two languages. I'm studying two languages. Oh, are you taking French and Spanish again? Are you taking? G silent? Or I can say, are you taking? Correct, are you taking? Or are you taking French and Spanish again? Well, I'm taking Spanish again, but I'm starting Japanese. Really? That's exciting. Exercise 3, number 2. Peter is Lisa's husband. 3. Frank and Lisa are Isabel's grandparents. 4. We have a son and daughter. We have a son and daughter. 5. My father-in-law is a painter. 6. Michael is looking for a job right now. Exercise 4. Wow! Do you like it? Yes, I do. I like it a lot. And is this your brother? And, and is your brother still working in Hong Kong? And is your brother still working in Hong Kong? Yes, he is. He loves it there. And how about your parents? And how about your parents? Are they still living in Florida? No, they're not. They're living in New York these days. How about you and your family, Chris? How about you and your family, Chris? How about Stris Unbi? How about you and your family, Chris? Are you still living here? Yes, we are. Yes, we are. We really love San Francisco. Exercise 5. 1. This is my aunt Barbara. She lives in Rome. But she's visiting Chile this summer. She's taking some summer classes there. Two. And these are my parents. They work in London. They're on vacation right now. Three. And here you can see my grandparents. They aren't working. Or they're not working now. They're retired retired to stop working four this is my brother-in-law this is my brother-in-law edward he wants to be a company director wants wa wa won't wanna he wants to be a company director he's studying business in canada right now he's studying five and this is my niece, Christina. She goes, or she's going to high school. She likes mathematics, but she doesn't like English. Exercise 6. Answers will vary. Exercise 7. A. Answers will vary. B. Number 1. False. Many college students live in university housing. True. Three. False. Few young people in the United States live with their parents. Four. False. Nearly all. Nearly all university students live with their parents. Five. True. Six. False. Rents in the city are very expensive. Many young people continue to live with their parents after they marry. Exercise 8. 
One, all, two, nearly all, three, most, four, many, five, a lot of, six, some, seven, not many, eight, few, nine, no. Exercise nine, one. Most children go to public schools. Few children go to private schools. Two. Many young people go to college after they finish high school. Some young people look for work after they finish high school. Three. Not many people over 65 like to use the internet. A lot of people over 65 like to spend time on a hobby. Nearly all people over 65 like to talk to family and friends. Exercise 10. In my country, some couples get married fairly young. Not many marriages break up. And nearly all divorced people remarry. Elderly couples often live at home and take care of their grandchildren. Exercise 11 answers will vary. Share videos. It's a community. We're all doing this together.